name is Jennifer and welcome to a vintage vanity. I am super excited for today's video because well you guys are here as well as we are doing yet another mystery haul video because I can't be stopped. I'm having way too much fun with these and I haven't gotten a dud yet so um yeah if you haven't seen the other video where I found this little gem I'm gonna place a link on the screen so you can go check out that and quite frankly if you missed that one you missed it probably because you're not subscribed to this channel so go ahead and uh, click subscribe so you're notified when I post new videos and also hit the notification bell because subscribing isn't good enough anymore they want to actually send you an email and be like hey Jen's on YouTube go check her out the mystery box I did this time was from Quirks and Kinks, and that is the retail store for the brooch company called a Lipstick and Chrome, which do some amazing brooches, and I'm going to link everything in the description box below, but they often will do amazing collaborations, and stay tuned to the end of the video because I have a giveaway, and I want to giving away some brooches and you can find out how you can get your hands on some amazing brooches but they uh, often do collaborations and they did one with Joanna Parker who makes like these amazing really like quirky vintage designs um I just love her stuff so much so they had a Halloween blind box for their collaboration with her so I was like you know what I'm gonna get that and then I noticed that if you spent $75, I think it was, you got a free brooch. And I was like, those are magic words. So then I said, you know what, I'm going to add another brooch on so I can hit that 75, which, okay, this is the one of the things I love. And a lot of companies do it, but they do like reward points, which is a great way to save money because, um, then you get reward points and then you get really good coupons and then it's like free money and then you can buy more pretty things. This is my logic. This is why I have my own dressing room. <laughs> and also, um, do you not think it entirely amusing? Like I'm dressed like it's the middle of summer and it's not. It's in the heart of spooky season and I'm about to open Halloween brooches. So, oh, I'm super excited. So I got uh, my box was packed by Amber. Love that. I love supporting like small female owned businesses. Ooh, right off the bat is this is the brooch that I selected in my add on where I was like, oh no, you mean I gotta get another brooch? Um, and I did decide to go spooky again, and I went with the Bat Woman brooch from La La Blue. I will place a link in the description to everything that I mentioned, and she is more magical than I could have ever imagined. I mean, guys, oh my god. I now want to make an outfit to match hers. I feel like the website doesn't do, like, the pictures don't do it justice. It's so, so pretty. And it is, it's got a lot of detail because I feel like it is a print on top of the, if it's resin or plastic, I'm not, I think, I think resin is plastic. Anyway, she's super cute. Love her. Two bits. So excited to add her to my collection. The uh, first brooch, and this is one of the things that I love about lipstick and chrome as well, is that their boxes are see-through. So if you choose to keep your brooches in boxes that they come in to keep the dust off them and stuff, you can easily see what is inside them. It's no longer like, where's the one I'm looking for? And uh, this is the Johanna Parker one, and it is, uh, but this one is as well, and it's the Boo Goose and the cauldron and the pumpkin cauldron. And I love this one because there's so much like going on. His little bow tie, he's holding a little wand, and he's like, ooh, and his little cheekies are so cute, and he's in a pumpkin cauldron. 
can anything say Halloween better than this? I don't think so. And the funny thing is, two of my friends, Midge and Heather, which have YouTube t channels as well, link in the description to check them out, both have this brooch, and it was super jelly that I didn't have it. So now I don't have to be jelly anymore, because now I'm the peanut butter. Whoo, so excited. Okay, so this is the Johanna Parker design, and again, it um, comes with the see-through lid on it, and she is... Just the cutest witch you've ever done seen. I, you know, I just, one of the things I love about the Johanna Parker designs is there's just so much detail that's like in the brooch itself. So it's like carved out and designed into the brooch. And I love that there's so many colors that go on. It, this one is like a little stained glass witch and I just really love her. Okay, and our next one is, it's so dimensional, is probably the thing that I love so much about her brooches. And um, we've got this just precious jack-o'-lantern with the, you know, the, the swirled, very subtle color going on in his pumpkinness, And then the bat, because bats are so cute. And if you notice the little bat, little bat fangs, because he's a bat and he's a vampire bat. <laughs> but he's also like fashion, so he has eyebrows. We're going back into the box for the third and final brooch from the Halloween box. And this is an Erstwilder. And this is also from one of my other favorite, like, uh, kitschy designers, which is the Kitschy Witch. Um, I'll place a link for her stuff too. She makes uh, clothes as well as accessories, but she collabed with Urs Wilder. And without further ado, <gasps> oh my God, I'm so excited. Okay, I do have to admit, I bought um, two of the released uh, collections from Urs Wilder from her because I love all her stuff so much. And, you know, it's one of those things where, you know, sometimes you, you complete your purchase and then later you regret that you didn't buy um, a certain one. Well, it's like uh, Kings and Quirks realized I really was sad that I missed the little pumpkin girl. Oh, she's so cute. And her little bangs and her little face and her little pumpkinness and her little dress. She does have a male counterpart as well um, that I think about him as well. But at some point you have to tell yourself you can't have all the brooches, right? Come on, what a good deal that was. I mean, honestly, you guys, if you are a risk taker and you're willing to risk like going outside your comfort zone, these blind boxes are just such a lot of fun. And I am not disappointed in the least with anything I got. I am so excited with everything. And I want to pass the love and excitement on to you guys. So I'm going to be giving away two lipstick and chrome brooches. I am so excited about these brooches. My dear, dear friend Heather from How To Be Fancy. If you don't know her, please go follow her over on Instagram. I will leave her link down below. She got to do the collab dream of a lifetime in designing two brooches in collaboration with lipstick and chrome. And I am so excited for her and so happy for her. She is just one of the most wonderful people I have ever met. And for her to be able to do something like this and to know how excited she was about it, I really wanted to support her. So of course, um, I bought brooches for myself, but then I brought extras because I wanted to pass them on to you guys. So I'm going to show you these brooches and then I'm going to tell you how you can enter the giveaway. And the first brooches is the, the cottage core kitten. If you know Heather, you know there had to be a cat brooch in her collection. And I love that this is a cat brooch that we haven't seen before. Um, the, the colors in it are just so beautiful and vibrant and it's just such a really cute vintage cat face on it and it has just a lovely, lovely, sweet, 
feel to it. And um, I can't wait to see you guys wearing one of these. The other brooch that I'm going to be giving away, because there will be two winners. One's going to win the cat and one will win the next one. Is the lady head brooch. And it has actual like little faux flowers coming out of it. Now every um, lady head brooch, the flowers might be slightly different. Um, but... Oh my gosh, who doesn't love a lady head vase? And now you've got a brooch that's a lady head vase. I mean, hello, how is this not already a thing? Of course Heather would bring this to life. And I am just so, so excited at how gorgeous this turned out. Are they not the cutest brooches you have ever seen? And I know you want to get your hands on them, so this is how you can do it. All you have to do is head right on over to my Instagram where you will find a post featuring these brooches. All the details will be on that post as well on how to enter, so if you forget, no worries. But all you need to do is be following myself and how to be fancy on Instagram. Then you have to like the post, and then you have to, in the comment section, tag two friends. That's it. To win, you do have to be 18 years old or older, but you can be located anywhere. So it is open internationally. As far as how long this uh, giveaway is going to run, you will find the date on the post itself. So I will see you over on Instagram. Of course, before you go, I'd love to hear in the comment section below your thoughts on today's video. And also let me know if you've ever done one of these accessory mystery hauls before and what your experience has been. I always love to hear from you guys down there. And of course, if you like today's video, go ahead and click that thumbs up. Now, before I let you go, a huge subscriber shout out to Angela McHutchin. I think I pronounced it right. I'm really sorry if I did not, but a huge thank you for commenting on my last video, for liking and watching my videos and just being a part of our cozy little online community. Of course, if you want to see a more of this face between uploads, be sure to follow me on all the social media as a vintage vanity. If you want to keep watching my videos, go ahead and check that video you see playing right there. If you don't want to miss a minute of what goes on here, make sure you are subscribed to this channel. And of course, have a great day and I will see you soon. Bye.